Hey nerds, it's your first day of three weeks of holidays. Now, I know some of you are at home just crying, trying to console yourself with the fact that you're not going to see Mr. Crank for three whole weeks. Just how are you going to get through it? And I know some of you are consoling yourself by doing a whole bunch of math study, just absolutely drowning yourself in math study. But for those of you that are struggling to make it through, I thought I'd make you a funny video just to brighten your day. So I have this, if my hands work properly, I'll even be able to pick it up. I have this, those extra spicy noodles that have been going around. So on the back, there's a table that you can't read very well because my webcam's excellent. That says how many Scoville heat units are in a packet. Now, what's a Scoville heat unit, you ask? So, uh, webcams are hard. Whatever. The Scoville heat unit's how we measure how hot chilies are. So, up the top here, there's like capsicums and air and things that don't really hurt you very much um banana peppers jalapenos <clears throat> serranos cayenne peppers sort of starting to get into the hot range um habaneros up here in the extra hot and then you've got the crazy things like scorpions and ghosts and carolina reapers and things like that up the top so the noodles are 8800 scoville which is sort of up here in the top of mild, which isn't really that scary. But um, I made some, importantly, showing off my Toy Story 2 chopsticks with the little three-eyed alien dudes. Um, yeah, I just thought it might be funny for you guys to see me eat some hot food and how I cope. So, enjoy. Now, 8,800 Scoville, as I showed you, isn't really that hot. So these are kind of nice. I can understand why your average Joe would be weeping at this point. But they're okay. They're not too bad. So what is bad? Well, if we go back to this... Banana peppers up here. Oh, got one of those. And, you know, they're kind of where the noodles were, so whatever. Yeah, they're crunchy. I dried them. One of them to last long enough to make it to this video. Um, things like jalapenos and Thai green chilies, they're up here too. Got to show you the inside to prove that there's some of that white stuff and seeds because that's where the hot bits live. Still, that's pretty fine. It's a bit warmer than the noodles, but we'll get there. Um, cayenne peppers. Oh, that one's that was hot for a green one. Um, cayenne peppers, <coughs> uh, serrano peppers, things like that. They're, they're up there as well. Thai chili sort of things. They're a bit warmer. Then you've got things like habaneros. Fingers are hard to use. Habaneros start to get hot. Yep. <clears throat> Still okay. But they're dried, sir. It's not even hot. Well, just in case, I've got this guy. Now, normally I only use this one for cooking because it's hot. It's not the hottest one I've had. This is Blair's number two sauce. I had the number one. I didn't like the taste of it. Number two, 550,000 Scoville. It's up here in Inferno. 
It'll be hot. <clears throat> I'm shaking a little bit from that habanero. <clears throat> Ooh, don't spill it. This stuff's really hot. <clears throat> yeah, that's really hot. I remember that guy now. <clears throat> and just in case you're saying, oh, but sir, uh, that's a sauce. That's not even a real chili. <clears throat> no, she's good. Um, I've got one last guy. Oh, if I don't drop it, hands are shaky from the heat. I've got one last guy to prove there's some seeds and white bits in it. This is a ghost that a quarter of a ghost. I've never had that much before. Only small amounts in cooking. But it'll be fine, right? It'll be completely fine. <clears throat> no worries at all. It's okay. I'll be fine. See you in three weeks. Bye. <laughs>